Troop here and we're back in Red Dead Redemption 2 and we're just going to carry on with what we're doing if you do enjoy the show as we're going through it um, please leave a like I'd really appreciate that and uh, subscribe if you haven't already otherwise I'll leave in the description below to get back to the playlist of the last episode if you have happened to miss any so we're going to be heading over here today uh, Bill Williamson let's have a little look what we've got over there um, go grab the horse and uh, get going <clears throat> middle of all this uh, coronavirus outbreak so uh, having a little game why not I haven't actually made a few of these in a while I've uh, okay, made man, the girl. previous two last week but I didn't manage to get them up so ooh. what happened there ah uh, it's because I'm in camp in it hmm. alright come on let's get out of here right so we'll carry on down hey. All good out here? Not really listening there. We'll keep moving. Hope everyone's alright out there and uh, getting through this uh, virus all healthy yeah. and that and no one's uh, losing anyone close to them. My, uh, oh, we've got some gunfire somewhere. My, uh, oh, I feel ya. Let's see what this hey is. Hey there, partner. You interested in a little friendly competition? Man, I've been looking for a challenge and I ain't found one yet. What'd you say? Uh, yeah, huh. except. Why don't we find out? Good. Whoever shoots the most bottles wins, okay? I'm going to do it with that. It's a bit faster than the other one. All right. All right, stand alongside me. As soon as you pull your weapon and aim, we let fly. Okay, go. That's right. Oh, shit. Ah, ah. Yeah. It's going to have yeah. another one here. Guess that explains it. I'm brand new. It's hard lines, partner. Here's an idea. What do you say we raise the stakes? <laughs> so yeah, this is where it gets better. It's that old come on, come trick. Some money. We'll be well, doing it, don't like you worry. I'll probably lose this. And then I'll end up accidentally shooting him like I did the last guy who had these little game play. How about yeah. this? You shoot four birds out of the sky before me. We'll call it a day. <clears throat> uh, right. Simple. We're doing first to four. You can count to four, I hope. Stand close. As soon as you see him, start shooting. Wait for it. There they go now. Come on, load your weapon. Oh. <sighs> All right, that boy. You got a damn good shot, mister. Here you go. As oh, I thought he was going to have another little uh, uh Thanks, friend. Jesus, how much money have I got? Three now. Do you know what? I might go to the Next shop today and have a little uh, have a little purchase of a few things, to be quite honest with you. Um, I actually haven't done that that much during... Oh. I didn't want to be doing that. I thought I was just going to uh, skin it. Oh, what? We're just shotting it in the bag. All right, okay. Let's just grab them all then. Why not? I um, thought we were going to get the options to skin it, but obviously not. We're just shotting it straight in the bag. Playing at that. We'll grab this one. Ooh. What am I doing? What am I doing? Right, okay. I don't know how big this bag is he's carrying. But I ain't complaining. Let me grab this. Call, call the horse. Uh, all poor. That would have been because of the gun I used. 
So let's carry on. We're going in town anyway. Um, we might have a little hey. look, maybe. All right, calm yourself down, mate. Carry on up out here. Come round. And we're already at the town, so we weren't too far off. We're not able to use the... Uh, oh, we've got a bounty here. Serious? Uh, probably for riding through a churchyard on our arse. Right, jump back on your arse, mate. All oh, right, okay. I'm trying to equip some guns, but here we go. Let's see what these two have got to say. Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job, needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them, and they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seem legit to you, Bill? Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what are they born in their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, uh, that's so. Yeah. They think it was the Braith ones. Listen, I know these great boys a bit now. This is I couldn't even way. walk around that. I tried. We're stuck in the middle of some ancient feud. But yeah, you're gonna walk around. Nah, no, you're gonna walk through this one as well. Perfect. They were saying the Catherine Braithwaite. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right. I could have told. Oh. All right, well, we've ruined ourselves in this town, then, by the looks of things. Guess get a better gun out here. Oh, good night. Oh, well, he... Oh, behind us. Quite a nice little town, this. Right, where have we got people? I'm too busy looking at the town here. Right, start. Come on. Where's he? Good night. Epic beard though, that friend. Yeah, all right, take your time. Oh, are you kidding me? Could I have gone through the back door, maybe? Who knows? Right, let's have uh, another bash. Bish, bash, bosh. Got some itchy knees, man. Well, I shut his hat off with a... Is this the best you fools got? Oh, he's gonna get it good. Oh, cowards are in the gun store. I'll get the front. You take the back. Oh. Is that right? But what's this fashion here? A double barrel shotgun. Enter the gun store the back door. Yeah, I'm trying. Oh, brake lock. Didn't even see that. Mate, 
feet. Yeah, we're in. You're getting sloppy, Morgan. Ah, uh, shut your fucking mouth. You see that window and Sean's skull? Don't talk to me about sloppy. Better in here, not there. What? <sighs> What's he doing? Stood in a doorway, shooting his way about, man. Take some fucking cover. Don't do it, me. Jesus Christ. Mind you, I needn't fucking talk. I was running across the deck here earlier on, getting gunned down. I even hear. Yeah, all right. Yeah, come on, let's load and get Not all of them. Sheriff Gray. And what about Bill? Where the hell's he? We'll find him later. Come on. Sheriff Gray! You need to get a hold on this town. It's going to hell. It's over. We put down far worse than you. A hundred times over. This is the Grays town. Always has been. Always will be. Only Grays I see left around here is you. You want us to come out? We'll come out. Yes. Oh, Bill. Guns on the ground, now! Both of you, don't do it! You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Sheriff! I'll blow his brains out! You want to join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? Shit. Good night. How the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what, six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Hurry him proper someplace quiet. Micah! Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. Well, the hundred pound bounty um, may have just uh, flew the fuck on through that roof. He was like an annoying little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. What a goddamn mess we are making of things. It's a nice view, that, isn't it? Probably why they used it for uh, fading in. Right then. Okay. I don't know why I whistled. <laughs> Sorry if that was a bit loud down the uh, the old speaker there. 
fact, let's have a little um, a little look how far away this is. Um, ah, it's not that far. It's not that far. I'll keep you with me. And even though I'm swallowing quite loud on the uh, on the mic there. And gulp and gulp. Oh, nearly straight into that tree. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I wonder what my bounty is around here now once I go across state lines and back over here. Or town lines, should we say. I don't know whether it's to imagine it's state. Presuming this is all them around the tent. <clears throat> Arthur, have you seen that boy, Jack? No. Where's my goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my son? They took him, didn't they? They took my son. Who took him? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. Like Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything. I where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him, we will bring him back to you, and we will kill any fool that had the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head. Abigail, you have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back, so help me God. Right now. Dutch, we just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. Rest of you. Let's ride! Yeah, boy, let's ride! Okay, let's go get that boy back! Well, alright, let's go. Ooh, ooh. I imagine this is going to be us out of, uh, out of here, yeah, to a new camp. We just camp. got shot to hell by the Greys in town. I know, I heard about Sean too. I don't want to even think about that right now. We have to focus on Jack. So I have to ride at the pa in back of the pack here, I can't speed up. I'll kill everyone there. Easy, John. Try to stay calm. I'm fine. It's gonna be a bit of a big battle if it's all of us going. There must be a lot of people there ready to get killed. I promise you that. What about the gold? Who gives a damn about the gold? Yeah, I've got to stay at the back here. I hate to break it to you, but I don't think there is any gold. If there is, it's hidden somewhere no one knows. What? I've turned every stone. Christ's sake, Hosea. After all that, another perfect scam. We underestimated them. No, they underestimated us. Enough talk. There is no point arguing how we got here. This is where we are. And we are going to fix it. So come on. Let's do it. Ooh, ooh. I look forward to a nice big battle like. So. Oh, these are them okay, trees, aren't they? Right. Nobody makes a move until I say so. Approach on this house all lit up. Ooh, ooh, it's gonna be fucking epic this. Come on. Come on, let's do this. Alright everyone, dismount and come to me. We'll go in on foot from here. Do you know what? Do, 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 do. I'm gonna keep my uh I'm gonna keep that and I'm gonna tr oop. That's my pump action. I can't keep that, can I? It's too, uh, I've not got enough ammo. Bolt action. Ah, that's the bolt action. Uh, double barrel? No, I don't want my double barrel. I want... It'll have to be that. I think what I'm going to actually be using is my, uh, my shotgun. Ah, no, I need distance. I need distance. Let's go. Shot, sure, I want to be able to run then. We should have stayed out of all of this. Come on, let's get this done, John. 
You sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin us. I don't. I'm think back so. at the back then. Yeah, yeah. There they are. Who steals a goddamn boy? I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches. John, I need you to stay calm. I think we're gonna lose someone else here. Get down here now, you inbred trash! What the hell do you want? Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged or otherwise, that is a young boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. Oh, they're really in. I've took down more than this on my lonesome mate, and there's about ten of us here, so go for it. If you ain't gonna be civilized about this. Right. <laughs> I just wanted to go guns blazing, guys. I just wanted to go guns blazing, but that was my that was my fault. I hold my hands up to that. That was me being a knob, and I did know at the very end that I was, I was just walking straight fucking into it, and I just thought to myself, I've got to turn, get out of here as soon as it is it's game over. There you go. You know they conveniently put some uh, put put some cover right in front of you. What the fuck was that? Yeah, go on, get down. Right, shotgun time. to go around it's one room at a time Jack. Oh. yeah good night Ooh, your angry face You fucking bleed. Come on down. Ooh, ooh. Where are you all? There can't be many of these left. More coming from the right. Come on down. Oh, I thought I had to go through the tree there. Let's run away into that room. Come on, this must be it. 
Oh, let's go. I can't see a goddamn thing. Oh, you give me an option to help. Yeah, let's do it. One, two, two three. Oh, right, I thought we were just going to launch the way through. Yeah, man. Yeah, boy. Oh, now he's decided to come in. Oh, yeah, slit a bitch's throat. Where's the boy? We have lived in this house for 120 years. We never had no problem except by Where Yankees. Where is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son! Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Common scum. Where is the boy? You filth. Oh, just start cutting her fucking fingers off. What about them? I don't know if we have, you know. No. No, we haven't been in like these rooms. What about the room next door? Hmm. I feel like if I don't check all the rooms, he's going to have been in here. Yeah, this one. Ah, oh, I can't shoot. I need to get in that room, man. There must be a way in this back door. Ah, I'm going to have to go out and round, Anna. I'm hitting the X as if it's going to take me... Um, as if it's going to make me go faster. Watch this one's going to be locked as well. Oh no. But this will be. Yep. This? Hmm. I feel like the boy's going to be in this house if I leave. I'm going to go back to my original idea. I'm going to go right round. I'm going to go see what that house was, that room was on the back because you can't get in through that door so how they could have possibly checked it I have no idea but that's this one right here okay right okay we've checked it all out we were just in that room Although this is locked, is it? Yeah, right. Nice slow walk all the way around because it won't let me run. <laughs> See if any of these. Where is it? Right now, I'm not allowed to loot one. Mind you, saying that we've got a fire going somewhere. So let's get out of here. And watch now it get turned around. His fucking head exploded, didn't it? You know, 150 years living in this house, fucking over because it's burned to the ground, you daft gun. They're gonna explode as well. Pop! And this guy. Pop! Pop! I 
never liked you. Why'd you take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite? You stole the boys my Boys are off limits. You stole my horses. Ain't no rules in war, mister. Matthews. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? My sons gave him to Angelo Bronte. So my guess is Saint Denis. Either there or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Arthur, come on. What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. No, execute her. Don't fucking leave her. Kill her. Oh, yeah, got a new run back inside. Burn yourself to death. That'll do us just fine. Scumbag. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. If I don't get that boy back safe, um, she, she'll kill us all. I know, but looking at this, logically, well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm him. He's right, John. What do you think, Arthur? The boy will be fine. But, well, of course Marston scared Rotten. We, we killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble <laughs> for nothing. No, no. Not for nothing. For living. Now we get that boy back, and we go. Trust me. Hey, Dutch, we got a problem. Not a problem. Visitors. A solution. Good day, fine people. Mr. Vanderland. Mr. Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan, nice to see you again. And to what do we owe the pleasure, Agent Moron? I don't know if you're aware, but this... This is a civilized land now. We didn't kill all them savages only to allow the likes of you to act like human dignity and basic decency was outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man, so in love with greed, he has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker. Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off, disappear, and go and live like human beings someplace else. You came for me? Risk life and limb in this den of lowlifes and murderers so that they might live and love? Ain't that fine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. In that case, it'd be my honor to join you. Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake. All of you. <laughs> yeah, dreadful. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All of you will die. Run away from this place, you fools. Run. Come on. Get your damn hands off of me, boy. Oh, I just gunned that fucker down. Right now, we get out of here. And quick. Any ideas? Towards Sandini. Hidden in the swamps outside Sandini. 
I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous occupiers. Place is well hidden. You and Arthur, ride out to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, you go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back, and we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Come on, John. Do you know who I didn't see? Crazy. Out of everyone here. Yeah, we need a new spot, Arthur. Is, oh, it's on there. Is that him? Is that him? I don't think it is, but I'll just check Micah. Why is he never the fuck around? Oh, is that him there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is. That's him. Right, okay. Scratch that. Don't matter. Didn't think anyone was there. He was there. I didn't see him at the beginning. Right, okay. Let's have a little ride out. Oh, we get some nice music on in the background as well. It's gonna be all right, John. We should be going for Jack. We will. That's why we we're to going to uh, first that San Denis, man. We ain't no use to Jack in jail. We're at the end of a rope. I don't even know what to think no more. Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this. Smart? Are you joking? <laughs> We made too much noise once again. We drew it right to us. I mean, how many people we killed in the past few weeks? Hey, wait up! Yeah, come on, Henry, the fuck up. Yeah, I was kind of hoping you'd stick with me, to be honest. Far too many. It's Dutch playing his games. Hosea, too. Getting involved with those two families. Master con men working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always? Look, Marston, I don't know what to tell you. Things don't always work out. That ain't nothing new. Jack's gone. We lost Sean, Mac, Davy, Jenny. And for what? We can't change what's done. We can only move on. But one day, we need to start learning from our mistakes. Come on, it ain't all bad. We've had a rocky run. We'll be okay. We'll get through it. <laughs> Dutch will fix it. Dutch will come up with a big plan. Right now, Shit. every plan oh, fuck, gets us getting into taken, worse yeah. trouble. We're getting further from where we're meant to be going. Now, you can't put all this okay. on Dutch. You're worked up. Rightly so. Just don't get too far in your head with all this. You'll never get out. It's a goddamn mess. That poor kid. We chose this life. He didn't. I don't know. I think this life chose us. You, me, Dutch, Hosea. It's been a long time now. All right. I still got some speed up now. down this path to the left here. So, back to what you were saying. Sure has. Lots changed. I sometimes wonder if... Things was ever the way we remembered them. If we were ever who we thought we was. Like I told you, don't go down a rabbit hole with this, Marston. That won't help nothing. That's it up ahead. Oh, here's the sound. Oh, oh, yeah, I remember this. We're moving up in the world. You ain't seen inside it yet. <laughs> Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. You sure this place is empty? I ain't sure on nothing. All right. Let's leave the horses here and take a look. It's not going to be empty, is it? Let's face it. We've got sandbags outside. We've got a little defense. It's them again, boys. Still some here. I can see that. You think there's more of them? Yeah, I'm pretty you fucking positive there will be, mate. He wasn't shouting. The guy next to him was he? He was obviously shouting some other fucking people. Oh. Get out of here. Now, go. Okay. Okay. I'm going. 
You were very close to being killed there, mate, right. Oh. Any more of you upstairs? I'm coming for you! You hear me? Who the hell do you think you are? There Come we go. Up with your hands up. You can still walk out of here. Where are you creeps hiding? Come out where I can shoot you. Tough guy, eh? Good night, mate. Here we go, straight into quick draw. I'll be honest with you guys, I don't even know how to activate it. I knew you'd come soon enough. You are some other coward like you. The bounty hunters. The freedmen, the carpet beggars, the army. Shut your fucking mouth. I was going to stand there. He was, he was loading his fucking gun. How's it looking up there? I think we're clear. Good. Come help me with this, will you? What do you do you help with? Yes, I'm just trying to look in the other rooms, make sure we're done here. Jesus. What am I meant to be giving you a hand with? Oh. Give me a hand moving these bodies. Don't want the others walking into this. Well, we might as well loot it before we um we move it. Hurry up. This fella's getting heavy. Yeah, right, he again yeah. Follow me. Throw it in for the crocodiles by any chance. What is it? Crocodiles or gators out here? Right, gators? We'll dump the bodies in the swamp over there. Alligators, surely. Oh really? So I've just got to go backwards and forwards in here getting fucking bodies. Oh, there's only a few. We're upstairs, two more. That guy ran away, didn't he? Well, you were the leader, so I would hope you have something on you. Well, and the others like have thirty cents or something. A silver pocket watch, well, all right. At least we can fence that in. I'm just shotting him. I take him down river a little bit. Shot him on one of the trailers, isn't it? Take him down river and shot him in. Well, we yeah, are down river because the fish and whatever. I've been dimpling on these fucking grubby as shit and disease ridden corpses and then you're fishing them out of the water and I wouldn't mind to think oh yeah it's been having a nibble on this fucking scruffy bastard oh I can hear the guess I didn't have to do that last body then Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. Come on. George? Yes? Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> Not now. Come on, Arthur. Can you believe that, girl? 
All I've got going on, and she wants to talk. Everything okay with you two? I got far more important to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea. So, where are we going? To take a look at this eighth wonder of the civilized world, San Denis, I keep hearing about. According to the map, the road up this way should lead us right in there. All right. I guess this day ain't over yet. Not quite. Good work back there, Arthur. Everything went okay? A few loose ends. Nothing major. And John? About what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We are going to get that boy back, whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. Subtly, of course. Public places, maybe start with the saloons. Anyone who can put us in contact with him. Of course. What about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. We should be safe for a few days here. And then? I think we need to move a little further. Put some ocean between us and all of this. The mess with those two families. Losing Sean. I see things differently now. For a long time, I truly believed a paradise lay somewhere in the West for us. But I just don't know anymore. So we're leaving the country now? Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Whatever we do, we'll need more money. In any case, we have more pressing matters to attend to first. Why is Duchess Hall so fucking small? Whoa. Okay, there she is. A real city. The future. Big cities. They're always repellent. Exactly. I'll find you in there. Go see what you can figure out. Yes. Chapter 4, San Denis. Right then guys, I'd like to thank you very much for joining me for this episode. It has been a bit of a longer one today. I hope you've all enjoyed it. If you have, hit that like, subscribe, and also share it out. Let me get a few more views on this. I would really appreciate it. Otherwise, guys, thanks a lot, and I'll catch you in the next one. See you later. Bye-bye.